Welcome back. When we last left off, a Brandon had entered the timber mist wards and found this sleeping dragon with very large uh, animated areas and this very friendly wizard called Darm. We also got the yellow gem on our amulet activated by a posh plant that I think we were responsible for bringing to life. It's really hard to tell, actually. Our friend Darm here only wants a quill. And I don't think we're going to talk to him because he'll just tell us that that's what he wants again. So I think let's get right to it and find it. Another big sign, but no front door. We've missed your calm and passive tone, Brandon. Yet you do have an upright and slightly tilted posture. Also, we think we might need this. That emerald is really wedged in there. Maybe we need a worm to get it. Do I remember how to play this game? That emerald is really wedged in there. Okay, other things at stake or present around us are this bird. That bird is definitely hurt. How can his wing bend like that? It apparently doesn't want an apple core with a worm in it. Why would a sick bird want that? That is a very strange question. Oh look, it's got half a worm in it. Yeah. This looks distinctly like it could be a path, doesn't it? But this game doesn't seem to like to show us which ways are traversable and which are not. Too warm for a robe there. Yes, right. But you have wrap and iced beverage. I wonder what it is. Is it tea? Hello? Anybody oh. down there? We could drop things in the well. Now, I, th I have the feeling that gems are going to... Cherry Boobly. That sounds very refreshing. So, we got the tulip. We haven't found a use for that yet. We got the note from... What's his name? Kellick? Our grandfather. Telling us we need to find Darm. We may not need that note anymore. And we have an amethyst, a peridot, a garnet, sapphire. We know that there is an emerald. I carved them there myself. Oh, you did. This is your old bench. And there is a mysterious chamber with gems sort of uh, embossed on it. Not sure what to do there, but we did try putting in one gem and it went up in flames. Don't know whether that's good or bad. And I'm guessing that we're going to have to put more gems there and there's some kind of a gem puzzle. But I'm not sure whether we're going to waste our gems before we learn more about what that puzzle is. Oh yes, a bubbling stream that we have seen. This must be where we got the tulip. Oh yes, and... Cave that looks a little bit intimidating. Unfortunately, a cutscene was just uh, trampled over by the by those technical issues. Um, this has been happening, I think, on and off today for me. The um, internet connection has been, you know, it was Malcolm. Has been iffy. I don't know if it was Twitch this time or if it was here, but whatever. We're gonna forge ahead. So I think we'll play that again, just so you can see what happened. Okay, we've just returned from some technical issues, and unfortunately we didn't get to see that last cut scene live. So I'm going to... <laughs> what the heck is that? Play into it again. It is Malcolm. His animation is rather mesmerizing. Love the work put into that. So, you're the hero thrown against me. Were there none to test me better? Or do you believe in old Bryn's lies? Perhaps your mother should assist you. Was that Bryn's My lies? mother is dead, sir. But yours lives. For surely she has dressed you. Yes, Be Brandon. Be careful, yes. boy. Do not insult a man with knives. 
Please move aside. I seek the cave. Beware, young fool. My grip may slip. Oof. No bother, sir. You miss the mark. I do not miss, except at will. Okay, so we have a moment here to make one choice, but if we don't do anything... If we don't do the right thing, he just freezes us and we die. Let's try grasping the knife. I must return your gift, kind sir. Ah. I leave you now. And dodge your sorrow. But I may not be nice tomorrow. <laughs> now that's scary. Which circus is he from? Seems like he always laughs precisely the same laugh. Uh, at least that was relatively civil. Considering it was our arch nemesis for this whole game, I think. He's a performer. We'll save over yellow. I think we're not in trouble yet. This is solid ice. It is, so we're not going in there yet. We can't use magic on it, can we? Ooh. Gee, this could come in handy if I get hurt. Wait a sec. Did we lose the yellow power by using it? Let's see if we can get a refill. Or does it come back in time? Good luck, Mr. Bush. I'm sorry. Good luck, Mr. Bush. I think you'll need it in this neighborhood. Yeah, right. Okay, so. I guess I'll have to wait for my amulet to regain its power. Okay, so it's a timed thing. Thank you for sharing that information, Brandon. So, now we know what the deal is with the Serpent Cave. We're not going in there yet. I tried to carve my name on this, but Nolby has been here forever. You did, did you? Huh. Nolby. He just goes on about the harvest. Can't you see? I'm trying to rest! I can see that, Nolby! I'm sorry, man! Could we get the bird to this? Because it sure doesn't want to eat a worm. Or at least we don't think it does. Oh, hello! These are good. I'll just take this topaz and this diamond. This diamond glitters in the sunlight. It, indeed it does, Brandon. Looks like a huge cough drop. <laughs> good observation, yes. And also, it looks like our power has been restored. What else have we got here? What a curious combination of colors. It is. It does look very lovely. How are we doing technically out there, Lexi? Are we still good? We're going to have to drop anything if we want to pick up more. Can I get another apple or is that just like our tutorial item? All is well. Good news. Hopefully that's a rarer disaster. Okay. Oh, don't go don't go back back there. And that looks almost like another gem, actually. If you get another apple, maybe it'll have a whole worm in it. Well, as far as we know, this one did. Okay, so save again. Because, you know, danger. What are you? Oh, yow! Ow! Ow! That snake bit me! Are uh, you gonna... Mm. Hmm. Where is he now? Okay, uh... Are we gonna die of that? Woohoo! Amazing! The effects of the poison are gone. Alright. Uh, so let's keep an eye out for a way to get past that snake, because I think we want one of these. Are they just apples? I don't know. So where are we going? But you ate half of the worm, and what self-respecting bird is going to eat after another creature? I guess it depends on how desperate they are, and that bird obviously isn't too desperate. Okay, so there's nowhere else to go past this sign. We've seen just about everything that we can see here. And our friend here is not going to comment on the danger sign. Or as you might call it, the anger sign. 
or as you might call it, the dagger sign? He may be injured. Uh, I'm gonna take that as a butt, but that doesn't mean he'll take scraps. Only the best. Uh, yes, right. Maybe we need a, like, high-class, first-quality apple here. So, do you think we have to do the gem puzzle? Oops. Where is our fabulous gem altar? Here it is. Any porridge left in there? Orange. Nice work. Very nice work. Very professional. That's gem gem. So, Brandon, you've grown up here. You've built things here. You can't tell me what this place is? Okay, what's to the east of here? This guy. Can we swap the gem with another gem? That emerald is really wedged in there. Hmm. Okay, let's save and play around with the gem tray. And if no that doesn't work, I'm going to need some ideas, and if that doesn't work, we might need to check the guide. If you put gems on the face, I don't know. The diamond is the one that looks like the shape of this. Nice work. Very professional. Nice work. Very professional. Let's check everyone just in case. Nice work. Very professional. Nice work. Very professional. Okay, so we just saved, right? more time just to make sure. Here we go. It vanished in a burst of flames. Okay, we've put in two gems so far total. It vanished in a burst of flames. It vanished in a burst of flames. It vanished in a burst of flames. We'll try on the front. It feels like some unseen force is pulling my gemstone toward the gold dish. It feels like some unseen force okay. It vanished in a burst of... It vanished in a burst of flames. It vanished in a burst of flames. Any porridge left in there? How do they get this so smooth? <laughs> what am I, a masonry inspector? Okay. So, normally I wouldn't do this, but I'm going to reload this. Gem disposal area. It is being pushed away from the dish by some unseen force. Ah, okay, so... It feels like some unseen force is pulling my gemstone toward the gold dish. It's like it wants gems. So I tried putting all these gems in there. Let's organize them. Maybe it needs one of every kind. Is there a kind that we... I don't remember what kind I put in yesterday, do you, or last time. Do you... do you remember? All I can think is that we need to put one of every kind. Emerald is what we put in last time? And an emerald looks green, is that right? You think we need an emerald? That emerald is really wedged in there. So maybe it's not up to us to do this yet. Why do you think we need an emerald? what we had last time, right? And I'm guessing we'll be able to find it again, because apparently there are just gems scattered all around this forest. Alright, let's consult with Darm again. Well, Branton, you still have not given me the quill I need. You just think we need it because it's in the statue, right? Well, Branton, you still have not given me the quill I need. <laughs> So, a bird would have a feather. That's the best lead we have. Well, Branton, you still... All right, old man. The only other clue we have is harvest. That's it. Can't you see? I'm trying to rest! Harvest. Are these my, my new shoes? Do we need to give him shoes, or is that just a random thing he says? Uh, uh, Have a diamond. Uh, uh, nope. 
Can't you see? I'm trying to rest! So he doesn't say harvest anymore. At all. I don't know. Do we need a... Do we need an acorn? I also haven't found another walnut. Go, sir. Uh, 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 are these my my new shoes? Hello? Anybody down there? We can't use the rope. Too bad I can't take a quick nap. I think I'm getting a rash. That's a shame. We do have the amulet. Oops. I hope I don't need that later. Where is everybody? I wonder if my green hat is still down there. Hello? Anybody down there? Hmm. Looks like Herman fixed this. Hmm. It is Herman. That bird is definitely hurt. How can his wing bend like that? Well, I've lost my acorn, but he's not going to give him an acorn anyway. We know that. Would you like a garnet? Why would a sick bird want that? Hello, Bush. Good luck, Mr. Bush. I think you'll need it in this neighborhood. Nothing else here, is there? Gotta click around and watch Brandon walk everywhere. Any ideas, Lexi? This is solid ice. I like his sense of astonishment. Oh, can the we go? The entrance is solid ice. Okay, we can't go this the way. The entrance is solid ice. Yes, yes, it's solid ice. But a diamond can this cut is anything. solid ice. Even solid ice. So cut anything, diamond. At this point, I'm just going back to our point of origin. Ooh, got another acorn. Now, there is a spring. I wonder if there's fish back under the ground. Quite a flow for such a small spring. That yes. big rock on the bottom looks pretty. I wish I had time to soak my feet. That big rock on the bottom looks pretty. We're not getting that though, right? I wish I had time to soak my feet. And why doesn't the spring continue into this area? Is it that long of a, a trek? A beautiful tulip. I'd hate to lose this in the spring. I'd hate to lose this in the spring. I'll lose it in a different season. This does look markedly like a rope that you could use to pull a bucket out of a well, Brandon. Why don't you do it? Well, Brandon, why don't you do it? Is this thatch, or just weeds thrown on the roof? A perennial question. I should plant one of these in our yard. Could be something that we're not doing, or it could be just something I've missed. You think the bird, right? Another peridot, proving that we can get more of what we need. And more of what we don't need. You can go there. It's cool that I don't need to be over here to drop it there, you know? Yep, lots of gems. And it could just be gems, but we still need the emeralds. Ooh, what's this? Onyx. <gasps> and something else, too. Aquamarine. So it could be that there are... I guess I'll put you here. And it does seem that we can put items down anywhere and the world won't forget they're there. That's pretty realistic. Lexi, I have an idea. Well, what is it? 
looks like the stream's doing well so far, after the technical difficulties, by the way. That's encouraging. Another Lavender Rose. Did we leave that one there? Okay, our amulet saved us from a snake bite. The bird is hurt. Excellent. That's an idea. Of course that's what we could do with an amulet. Right? Why didn't I think of that? Roses are a gem. Will the bird peck the emerald out of the statue? This looks distinctly like it was done with some kind of a smear brush back in the day. Let's read our note again, especially if we don't need it. Malcolm has broken free. Soon he will come for me. Please help Brandon. Direct him towards the amulet. Use the Lavender Rose to key the spells. Darm and Xanthia should be able to help. Be careful. Don't try to get all of us. Count So we'll have to put that note somewhere too. I don't know. I want to put that... I kind of want to leave it with Grandpa, but... It doesn't look like Malcolm is bothering the Kyrandian Garden Club. Hmm. Good observation, Brandon. Brendan, Brandon, Brondon. All right, here we go. Of course, I was thinking too rigidly. I wanted to heal him. Well, no, I wanted to give him some food or something. Okay, so... We're standing beneath the bird. We can't drag it, can we? No. If I heal his wing, uh -huh. he'll have to give me a feather, won't he? Precisely, Brandon. That's your logic. Long range sparkles. <gasps> he was he was surprisingly correct. Plus it has that nice swoopy animation, of course. Goodbye. Goodbye, my friend. You can get a musical theme for doing that. Ah. Uh. Hope this qualifies as a quill. <laughs> that tickles. I'll just put it down here. We're a Disney princess. And now it's time to get back to... <clears throat> Timber Miss Woods. Alrighty. So. <clears throat> this is kind of rare that this happens, but Brandon does look more like me than most other video game protagonists happen to look. I don't know if our voices are identical. I feel like I have to struggle to imitate him, but maybe if in a, you know, Nature versus nurture. I might have grown up sounding close to him, given other surrounding variables. So, I don't know. I don't usually care whether I match the protagonist. I don't think that's the point. The point is to pretend. But it's kind of nice to see. All right. Here you go. Ah, you have my quill. Why did I want it? You are the master of scrolls. Write him one to aid his quest. Of course. You'll need a magic scroll. That's it, Darm. For mystics with no magic left, you all seem to have an awful lot. Malcolm's hold grows ever stronger, and soon no spells of ours will work. So take the scroll and use it later. Yes, all right. Well, thank you. Good. You have the scroll. Next, you'll seek another tool. Another tool? 
<laughs> he must find his birth stones. Birth cones? Ah! There we go. You mean birth stones! The seasons have their gems. Place each in order on a plate, or something like that. What are my birth stones, and what plate? Summer is the first. I think I hid that one somewhere near. That is all I can recall. I summoned all your stones, but my spell has gone awry. You will have to choose from whatever lies about. Mm. I like his voice. Whatever lies about. Now, Brendan, Brandon, Brandon, I don't think you didn't know which plate. Secondly, <laughs> the dragon wife had a great eye roll in there. I don't know if you caught it, Lexi, but if you already liked this dragon, I imagine that would only increase your appreciation for her. Okay, I guess we're going to need to st store the scroll. So what did he say about the birthstones? Summer is first? Let's see if he will reiterate any of that for us. Your Britain, solve your birthstones quest, then return here. Okay. Will the scroll help us with this quest? Huh. That probably isn't going to help us unfreeze the ice. Your Britain, solve your birthstone's quest, then return here. Hmm. What the heck? So, w Lexi, why did you say Amethyst is second? Are you just spitballing again, or did you actually deduce that? Looks like a huge cough drop. What a curious combination of colors. This is the darkest gem I've ever seen. I thought he said summer is first. It would be mean of the game only to give us that clue once, knowing that we might even miss it. The bird is back. Is that bird always here? No, it's not. Right? Lexi says, well, if it's the actual birthstones, then Amethyst is second because it is the birthstone for February. Okay. If we're supposed to put all the birthstones in one after another in the order of the months, but that would also ignore summer is first. And it has nothing to do with Brandon specifically, right? Wait a minute. We were able to ask the guy about the quill. Can we ask him about the birthstones? Can't you see? I'm trying to rest! No, I guess not. I've never felt more desperate just to run to the guide for advice about the birthstones. How else could we possibly know? If it's seasons, there are only four seasons and four gem symbols on the altar, then I don't know. Good point about the seasons. Could it be that there are only four of these stones which are monthly birthstones so maybe we go summer fall winter spring are we gonna have to look this up i'll do a little research here live birthstones wikipedia all right Birthstone is a gemstone that represents... Yeah, we know what it is. Okay, so. Some common birthstones. Garnet. Amethyst. Sapphire. Emerald. Onyx. Topaz. Peridot. There are definitely more than four.
There were a lot of them. Turquoise and Onyx are both birthstones for July, and we have both. June is also marked by turquoise. That's also historical. <clears throat> uh, there are zodiacal birthstones. Uh, you don't want to do it together, Lexi, if we're going to do it? I wonder if there's fish back under the ground. Uh, let me check the zodiacal birthstones. Yeah, let's hold off and just see if we can come up with anything first. Okay, let's look at the zodiacal ones. Aquarius, which is starting in late January. Garnet. Pisces Amethyst. Aries Bloodstone. Taurus Sapphire. Gemini. Is it Agate? How do you pronounce that? Agate. Okay, Cancer is Emerald, and that's the one we need. You're right about Amethyst being in February. Leo is Onyx. Virgo is Carnelian. Libra is Chrysolite, or Peridot. Right? Scorpio is Beryl. Sagittarius is Topaz. Capricorn is Ruby. Is one of our stones a sapphire? Yes. Okay, so we have amethyst, sapphire, emerald, onyx, peridot, topaz, and ruby. Uh, diamond is not on this list. Hello? Anybody down there? So, it's possible that there's something in game that will help us here. The game has been a little bit good about... Diamond is usually June, but it varies because it's silly. Right. Yeah. So this, there is so much variance. It seems wrong to me that a game would expect you to to know this. or to... one of these in our yard. Yes, thank you, Brandon. It seems odd the game would expect you to know all this stuff about birthstones. It's not in the manual or anything like that. There's no... There's no help of that kind. So I think I'm at least going to entertain the notion that someone here can help us. The altar has four symbols, yes, and they're all diamond shaped. Maybe it's an order thing. I do want to kind of wander around and see if our good old friend Merith shows back up. And maybe we'll also check back with Bryn too. And our grandfather. It's a good time to do a lap. We could also try one by one, but we don't even know if we'll get an indication if we're on the right track or not. But we still could. We could experiment with it. I don't suppose you're going to do anything else for us, Forest Alter. And also, remind me here. What did the weeping, uh, the the weeping willow, do for us? Where are these tears coming? Yeah, you don't want any more tears. Walk on around, Brandon. Walk on around. Always checking for paths I missed. We just healed it, but didn't something float down from it like the feather, too? I forget what it was. Grandfather, can you hear me? And of course. Rocks. And of course. I thought my sandals were in here. And of course. Anything in here? The Mystic Book Club. Nice covers, but lousy reading. We've seen about all we can here. The tree was right. The land is dying. Yeah, um, I don't actually remember what came out of that tree. 
but I really do think I remember that feather-like motion. <clears throat> However, through the magic of, you know, standard issue archival, I can quickly check on that as well. I did a great job. That's what he'd have said. Oh. Well, I thought I remembered that, but I don't see it. It looks like it was just what cued Merith to come around. I did a great job. Maybe I should become a tree surgeon. Yeah. I did a great job. Now Maybe you're not I should scroll become a tree. tree surgeon. The dragon's name is Brandywine? That's good. And I also healed this tree before I got my healing spell. Ooh, a new one. A pearl. Oh man. I don't want to drop anything though. Doing okay there, Lexi? Let's see. There's another one of these green ones close to where we... That's a cool sound. Close to where we need to go, so I'll leave the green one. Green, you here? You in? No music here either? I'll bet this incense burner is why Bryn always smells so good. Yeah, huh? Hmm. No donations accepted, I guess. Hanging posters, are you? Nope, nothing else happening here. So we now have access to ten stones. Wow, you could write dialogue for this game, Lexi. There's my backup stash for emergencies. You can kind of use it as an instrument. We'll have a secret cave full of gems as well. There we go. Stump smash. <laughs> Excuse me. And still the mystery of how we get the emerald. You'd think if it if we are officially doing this birthstones quest, we should have a lead on this by now. You'd think there'd be some <clears throat> birds on this. Birds? This looks like an old mystic. You'd think there'd be some birds on this. I don't take that as a hint, Brandon. Stop doing that. Feels like some unseen force is pulling my gemstone toward the gold dish. It feels like some unseen force is pulling my gemstone toward the gold dish. Did you say it more slowly that time? There was also the, the tree with the snake, yes. Good point. It feels like some unseen force is pulling my gemstone toward the gold dish. Feels like some unseen force is pulling my gemstone toward the gold dish. It feels like some unseen force. All right, we get the idea. You're not going to vary that, are you? And as far as the snake, uh, well, we could try using the scroll up there. You know. Why not? Pearl is kind of really different, isn't it? I think it was on at least one of the list of burns, birthstones I just checked out. Yeah, still not sure what the deal is with that. Bite Snatch Heal. Okay, I say... I say... 
we... Well, wait a minute. We can try one of these experimentally. I don't know. Which one was summer again? That was one of them. That was one of them, too. Okay, let's just try it. I'm unusually willing to go back to save files in this game. I see now. Oh? Well, that's consistent with our seasonal theory, with summer being first. So Onyx was July. Let's go forward three. One, two, three. Barrel, which we've never seen. Well-known varieties of barrel include emerald and aquamarine, but emerald is also June. However, topaz is also a fall stone. Didn't we have a topaz? Yes. Okay, let's see if this does anything. That's impressive. Okay, he likes that. One, two, three. Amethyst would be in winter, February to March, right? This is not fair. Oh, you didn't like that one. Hmm. Did we have a garnet? Wasn't that the green one? Garnet would be another possibility for winter. Peridot. Darn it. Did we have a garnet ever? I have a garnet. Yeah, that's right. There's one back in the cave. Okay, and then... Let's say we use garnet, and then sapphire would be fourth. Okay, let's try that. That might be it. And if that's it, then we can congratulate ourselves for working it out without consulting any hints. Okay. So, Onyx. I see now. Topaz. That's impressive. How does he know? Nothing's different. Garnet? This is not fair. Garnet? Darn it. And then the fourth one would have been Sapphire. I'm getting tired of this. Okay, so it's not Garnet. <clears throat> so... We had to go four. You think those lines are just what he says? So if we do Topaz first and he says that's impressive, then you're right, Lexi. Here goes. I see now. Hmm. He says I see now again. That's impressive. Okay. But did he say those because we're right? Does the order not matter as long as we get the right stones? What about this? This is not fair. I'm getting tired of this. Why am I doing this? I see now was always first, but he didn't usually, he didn't say that in the past. There's something about the stones that we chose. This is depressing. What do I have to do? <laughs> That's impressive. He approved of the garnet. He didn't say that wasn't fair this time. This is not fair. Confusing. I see now. Ugh. That's impressive. This is not fair. I'm getting tired of this. Hmm. It's an 
order thing right, so something must happen when we put the correct one in first. You'd think, yeah. I'm thinking about other things too, like... Do we need to spell Brandon's name with the first initials of the stones and abstract stuff like that? Well, what do you think? Should we take a peek at the guide? I'd like to use the guide as the thing that we use. Because it apparently does what the good old Discworld hint system did. You think it's season, so there are four, right? Now, but if that's true, then wouldn't he say different things if you went Onyx Topaz than if you went Topaz Onyx? This is the darkest gem I've ever seen. It doesn't give you much insight. But maybe Onyx and Topaz aren't right in that order. Onyx is the only one which is firmly entrenched in summer, except for Emerald, which we can't get. Your Brinton, solve your birthstone's quest, then return here. Now you don't tell us a thing about the gems, right? Your Brinton, solve your birthstone's quest, then return here. You don't help at all either. Uh, uh, are these my my new shoes? That's a great idea. Leave all the gems we can find at the gem altar. That emerald is really wedged in there. Can I cut this out with a diamond? That emerald is really wedged in there. You'd think there'd be some birds on this. Use the scroll on it. That emerald is really wedged in there. Doesn't look like Malcolm is bothering the Kyrandian Garden Club. Doesn't look like Malcolm is bothering the Kyrandian. That's still not helping us much. He did say we should use this later. Oh, we can just carry one thing in hand too. That's good. Brandon, you are too distracted by flighty thoughts of birds. Anyway. Alright. Yeah, this is an awesome idea. Do you think there are going to be 12 stones? Including the emerald? Let's go get more, shall we? And if there are 12 and one is emerald, we should expect to see 11 more types lying around. We had a garnet already. We didn't have a peridot. We have nine, including the peridot, right? And these don't count. Yeah. Now we've just been here, so if other stones have shown up, it's hard to know where, when, how, or why. Emerald and Rose. And we can't get the saw back, right? Herman's just gone. We haven't seen him around. Maybe one at the bottom of that spring. Yeah. Just not sure how we would get it. Because he doesn't seem to want to reach in there. I did a great job. Maybe I should become a tree surgeon. It's totally not clear what the deal is with that tree. Yoink. Do we need to use some stones twice? Hello, Dagger Steve. You are exactly right. 
It appears there is some precious stone puzzling going on. <laughs> Dagger Steve, we have reached our first point of seriously considering acquiring some subtle intelligence. How convenient that you should appear. I'm not sure if you remember this game well enough that you could supply it. On a side note, Timber, Miss Woods. No, that wasn't the side note. The side note was I increasingly feel that I have played this game. I think I remember the gem dish. I remember being frustrated that I didn't know what to do. I think I remember Malcolm with his swords, his daggers, you know? And throwing the dagger back at him like that. I just do not know where in life I experienced this. It's very strange to have that memory feel like it's resurrected. Brandon will go back here if I click on the danger sign, because I'm really clicking back there, I guess. And there is a snake there. It does look rather gem-like, doesn't it? Can I... Wait a sec. Let the snake bite you, grab the thing, then heal. Right. I am actually haven't tried to grab it a second time after healing. Let's see. At least I'll get this. Ha! All I had to do was heal. Now I have a ruby. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So that does leave just the emerald that we need, right? Do we now have eleven of the twelve birthstones in order? Garnet, amethyst, um, rubies in there. Beryl is aquamarine. Chrysolite is peridot. Carnelian is one that I have, but I don't think we have one of those, unless it's just a diamond. Dagger Steve, no help here, sorry. That's all right. So, Darm, when we did give him the quill by healing that bird, using our healing amulet power, thank you, Lexi, for that, said that we need to solve our birthstones quest next very unclear what that is, um, but it has something to do with putting these stones in this dish, quite possibly in the right order, and we think we heard Darn say, summer is first. Don't really know what that means, except maybe if a birthstone corresponds to summer, then we should put it in first and carry on from, from there, maybe. So maybe we can order these in the meantime. Garnet is the earliest sign, starting in January. That's right. And there's one more stone that we can't get, but we know where it is. Seems very much part of the puzzle to me. Bloodstone is March. Not sure what that's supposed to be. Heliotrope, also known as Bloodstone. Sapphire comes after Bloodstone. Agate comes after that. Which is like a quartz. Then comes Emerald, which we don't have. Then comes Onyx. Then comes Carmelian. And Chrysolite is, once again... Dot. And Beryl is Aquamarine. And then Topaz and Ruby. 
and then we're all the way back around at the start. So these three don't have zodiacal birthstone, are not zodiacal birthstones as far as we know. So assumed knowledge of birthstones is being asked of, we think, maybe. I was commenting that that seems a stretch. I've read the game's manual and there's nothing about birthstones in there and nobody else in this game seems to be up for educating us on birthstones or anything like that. Aquamarine is March IRL. So I've also found that there are a lot of different lists of birthstones and they really vary between countries, between blah blah blah. So who knows what list this game is using. If you have a particular list you want to send across, uh, feel free. That emerald is really wedged in there. There's nothing else that he can do to get that emerald. That emerald is really wedged in there. We can try using the, amethy the amulet power. But we think it's just for healing. See, this could come in handy if I get hurt. So there are really two stones that we needed to go out of our way for. The ruby's one, and this is the other. But we still don't know how to get it. Ugh, what a messy housekeeper. Hmm. Let's check the spring. And nothing for the well, too. We can't go down there. Hello? Anybody down there? And nothing in here? I carved them there myself. Mr. Bush is here. And we have a solid ice entrance to this cave. We're not going in there anytime soon. I think the spring is up this way. One more. Yeah. Quite a flow for such a small spring. Wonderful. Ah, it's beautiful. We found it. What is it? Sunstone. Sunstone. Didn't we need a sunstone? It was just about clicking in the right place. Uh, bloodstone. Okay, so is this, uh, was this game made in the US or is this a British developer? The actors all sound American, or at least North American. So maybe I'll check the US. No, no. Uh, the US monthly list. Of which there are a few versions. And they don't differ too much from the most recent Britain list. They all have Garnet as January. Sun, summer, maybe. Okay, Garnet. Amethyst is February in most lists. March, Aquamarine, or Bloodstone. April, Diamond. Nice. May emerald or chrysoprase? Small quantities of nickel. Uh, but most most say emerald for May. June, pearl or moonstone. So we let's go with pearl. Okay. July ruby. Or carmelian, but ruby. Peridot is in all of the lists for August. September Sapphire. It looks so beautiful. Opal is on all the lists for October. Topaz, November. And Turquoise or Lapis Lazuli for December. Do we have Turquoise? No. And Onyx is nowhere on these lists. So that's the problem. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, uh, 5, 10, 11, and so we still have an emerald. Oof. Oh, but we didn't use our sunstone. That seems to go nowhere. Maybe sunstone's like the, the kicker that starts things off. Westwood or US, thank you. Really wedged in there. 
Yeah, good question. Folks in 92, it's really tough to tell. You can't drop any more items in this scene. Oh my gosh. We've broken the game, almost. We've pushed it to its limits, at least. 